on the train now. Uh, we feel like we've got on the wrong train. We're not sure, but we'll just do a spread and we'll see. We don't know. It's 50-50. If we get off somewhere not Rivington, uh, we'll embrace it. Aoife, I've got something to tell you. So basically last night, I was looking up like the luckiest man in the world and it, it came up with the unluckiest, luckiest man in the world. Right. So it said that he had survived a uh, train derailing, a uh, plane crash, a car crash and a bus crash. <laughs> yeah. So I was like probably I was like, what if our train derails? So I hope I've not like put up some, yeah. also some bad luck. So my anxiety was playing up. And that's why I'm glad that your dog's here helping me out, <laughs> putting her head on my knee. Because it's really calmed me down <laughs> and making me less anxious. <laughs> you just look so cute, don't you? I feel like Petra's talking about the flag. I'm gonna go walk in the street. Yeah, fucking sister. Like, accompanying me. I don't know if that's a word. You can just see a little, like, smiley face. We've lost her. Right, we've gotten off at our stop, but we have to walk 50 minutes to get to the actual destination. Right, basically the guy that we had to show our tickets to, he said that we've got an issue here and we've done something completely wrong. Now, whilst I was uh, getting my mask, Ethan was the one that got the tickets. And uh, no, I'm gonna, I was saying something nice here. And to the guy, I said, well, actually out of the two of us, uh, Ethan's a smarter one. Cause uh, I would have gone us to like Africa or something. So basically, even though Eve has made this mistake, I know that mine would have been a lot worse. So I'm glad that <laughs> Eve has paid for it. We are crossing the road. <laughs> we can't yet because we're gonna. <laughs> that, that just showed us. In the end of that train palaver, uh, the man, the nice man, offered us a refund. He came back and physically. Yeah. He doesn't know if it'll actually work, but he wrote something down. Uh, at the end of it, he wrote his number down, and he said. Don't be ringing my number, you. And I said, I'll ring your number. And he said, Don't, my missus will go mental. <laughs> right, Eve is saying how we got let off because we were girls, which is true. Like, a guy would have got a slap on the wrist. Us two, we got a refund. Um, so Eve was like, Only because you were acting proper dumb. And yeah, that wasn't acting. Um, I actually started being dumb on the train. So he was obviously like dumb blonde and he gave us a refund. <laughs> Guys, if you ever get into a train palaver, we well, need to back get another ticket, uh, dye your hair blonde and act dumb, and then you'll get a refund. So right now, we are walking. <laughs> I have no idea where we're walking. <laughs> we're walking to Radlington right now. On the way to Rivington. Right, for some reason, I feel better vlogging here than I do when I'm in my house or in like the place where we live. I feel like because everyone's a stranger, I'm not going to see him again. You guys, I've had some sheep. Sheep, sheep, sheep. We must now cross the motorway and hopefully we don't die. Guys, I'm so excited. I've just earned my first boat shoe badge on Fitbit. So I've done 5,000 steps already and we're literally not even at the destination. Also, I've made Aoife uh, walk ahead of me because I was like, Aoife, I need to speak that confidently. So I'm going to run. <laughs> my pocket's open. We're at the starting point now and quarter to one. We're at the bottom of Rivington Pike. We're about to start our walk up now.
we're at the top of the pie. It's a pie. <laughs> we're at the top of the pie. So what I'm saying is, we've ended the trip. It's our final destination. Soon. Stop saying final destination. It makes me scared. <laughs> yeah, I'm uh, have you seen the film Final Destination? Of course I have. That's why I'm so scared of everything. It was that's okay. Final Destination. Watching that as a kid started my anxiety. I tell you. I used to watch Jaws and stuff like that. Oh my gosh, my dad used to always watch Jaws and like just all these like films. Um, so basically, we'll go into the train station now, and then we're gonna probably walk home. And then that's what we've done today. So I really hope you enjoy. Like so I really hope you enjoy what I have to say. So today we have walked 21,000 steps and I have burnt off 1,900 calories and I have only eaten about 700 calories. Woo, health! And I have not got enough sleep, enough water or enough food. But I have walked twice the amount I was supposed to. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> I just caught you freaking sleeping. We are nearing home right now. Me and Aoife are about to say farewell. So, thanks for watching. Bye, guys. Bye. See you on my next video.